I entered my cat Sophie in this competition because when she was a kitten, right from the very beginning, and when she was a kitten, she was about five, six weeks old when we got her, she laid right here, right on my neck, for months, straight, and then it turned out I had thyroid cancer. So I had to have treatment, and the entire time I was preparing for treatment, she still would lay, and as she grew, still touching my neck. And then once I had my treatment, and I'm now cancer-free, Sophie doesn't lay on my neck anymore, and that's why I think she should be New Jersey's top pet. I've lost her. So at the end of the day, when I get home from work, I find great pleasure in sitting around with my cats, and I do have seven, and once they're all settled and calm, it's so therapeutic. Sophie's got this strange obsession with water, and we always find her in the bathtub. This is Annie, and everyone should vote for her as New Jersey's top pet because she is the ultimate Jersey girl. She loves the beach, loves her family deeply, and loves food. Italian food. One, two, three. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. You're such a happy puppy. Come here, Can I have your other paw? Good girl. Can you lay down? Good girl. Can you speak? Good girl. loves traveling up and down New Jersey and has an Instagram called, and her name is Garden State Golden, and on that page she showcases all the different places in New Jersey that she visits. She also likes to do random acts of kindness called Annie's Golden Surprises, which are gift cards and little notes that she leaves around different NJ towns for people to find. She does this because she likes to spread smiles across our state and she loves the state and the people and living here. What? He's about three and a half years old and he is our pet, a member of our family. He is our guinea pig. He's Kirsten's guinea pig, my daughter, so I guess he's my grandbaby. He's just basically a, a, just a good pet and you know, he can't have the run of the house, obviously, but sometimes when we're sitting in the other room watching TV, you know, he'll come and sit with us on her lap, mostly. And um, he is just a really affectionate, lovable little guy. He likes to squeak. He likes to pop around in his little pen and um, have his free time running around on the bed or just kind of hanging out. And uh, never thought I would fall in love with a little guy like this, but he really does melt my heart. <laughs>